Start by finding the join in the PVC or rubber and remove the cover plate if there is one. My top tip is a gentle heat gun, a screwdriver and some patience. The PVC on Damselfly here was old and brittle and I really wanted to reuse it. This video is obviously sped up so you can see the patient and slow approach that I used here and it worked well. Once the PVC is off, clean up any grime that's in the way. Then remove the screws holding the aluminium frame on. Note I left some strategic ones in until the end because I was working alone. Now that it's removed, clean the PVC and the aluminium properly. So my next tip is seal the aluminium onto the boat. This will stop some of the rainwater running down the back of the rub rail and then dripping in through the screw holes. This part of a boat is essentially a sieve. Here you can see me applying heat to the aluminium. That's because I'm working on a very cold day and even just a little residual heat will help the sealant adhere. I also applied heat to the screws because I chose to put a little dollop of sealant on each one as I screwed it in. Although I didn't capture it on video, I also removed every screw that holds a top fiberglass deck onto the hull and applied sealant on each one of those as well. Lastly, you can reheat your PVC strip and prise it in with a screwdriver, again working your way all around. I hope my tips are of use to you too and thanks for watching.